fear is a very, very real emotion. There's not a person alive that does not experience fear on some level. Don't you believe that for a minute? I face it all the time. Fear is so big and so prevalent today. Nothing produces more failure than does fear. It is the fear of failure that freezes people before they even start. It is the fear of failure that causes you not to want to deal with the rejection and the potential hurt that failure causes. So fear cripples you on so many levels. But how is it that some people somehow manage to get by anyway? What is it that you can do that would help you overcome whatever fear you're facing? Well, here's what I was taught, and this has helped me in my life, my career, my family, my jobs, my ambition, everything. You overcome fear with your dreams. I want y'all to listen to me closely. You overcome fear with your dreams. Steve, how my dreams gonna make me overcome my fear? Because I want you to listen to me. Because the dream is everything. The Bible says a man without a dream or a vision shall perish. The dream is everything. See, if you have no dreams and visions, you will perish. You will die in fear. You will die sitting somewhere in fear without dreams and visions. Dreams are the counterpoint to all fear. I want you to dream so big. I want you to want something so incredible. I want you to dream of having something that's so spectacular that if it doesn't happen, you would be miserable. Man, if I don't make this dream come true, I'm gonna be miserable. I want you to dream so big that not reaching your dreams is unacceptable. You cannot live in this world without the dream and the vision. You can live in this world without your mother, your father, your brother. You can live in this world without a wife, a husband. You can live in this world without a lot of things. But what you cannot live in this world without is dreams and visions. You will perish without those things. You have to dream of something and want something. That's what keeps pushing you forward. So if you want to overcome your fear, you do it with your dreams. And here's the side note. God is in the make your dream come true business. Ain't he? He do it all the time. I'm telling you, man, God does it all the time. He makes people's dreams come true. What are you dreaming about? Explore what you're really dreaming about so you can lose your fear. You're afraid to open your business because if your business fails, you'll lose the money you saved and you won't open your business because you might lose your job when your boss find out. Dream bigger. Dream of what opening that business could do for you. The feeling of freedom that you would have. The, the extra money you could make. What you could do for your family. The things you could leave a legacy of. Maybe your dream ain't big enough. Maybe you got the dream of owning a large company. Maybe a mom and pop store. Maybe you dream of climbing the corporate ladder. Maybe you dreaming of becoming the supervisor or the CEO of the company. You got the dream so big that if this dream don't happen, you'll be miserable. Once you can do that, you can press through your feet. You can move forward. You can get on with it. I'm telling y'all, I was taught this. Dream so big that you can't imagine your life without living your dream. And then guess what? You can supply the fortitude, the strength, and the courage to face your fear and move on with your life. Dreams is the key to overcoming your fear.